Hello everybody, my name is Ben, I am a deckhand, and today I have a hunting video for you guys. This hunting trip was very special because we got the quality deer tags for the Alta unit, which is a very hard tag to get. My dad has been putting in for it for 20 years, and this year we put in for it as a group of me, my dad, and my cousin. And we were just fortunate enough to actually draw it for all three of us. And before I get into the video, if you guys could really help me out and hit that subscribe button, like, and leave a comment. I'm trying to get monetized, and that would help me greatly. Thank you very much, and enjoy the video. I don't see. So the last footage that you guys just saw me do is me turkey hunting. This footage that you guys are about to see is of me quail hunting. But now, before I get into this footage, there is a couple very important things that you guys need to know. All the land around us that you see is all private property. So I am shooting from a road, but it has nothing to do with the city. It is an unmaintained road owned by the guy on private property. Yeah.
right where those birds are, I think there's there's one down right there. Yeah, I got one down. They're all going to say goodbye. I'm gonna let the dog out. That's you wanna take one more shot right there. Yeah, take one more shot at that group. Hurry up. Straight up from you. I know, but they're they're behind the snow ledge a little bit. Got there two, go. got two. Now you got a few. I'm turning the dog loose. That's enough. Okay, get it. Okay, go get it. Go get it. No, 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 no. Get over here. Get up there. Go on up. Go, on up. go get it. Come on. Get it. Go on. Call her up. Come on. Come on. Go get it. No. Go get it. No. Come. Hey. Hey. No. Come. I'm out of I'm out of rounds. Just get the ones you have. Go get it up there, up there. Okay. Call her up. Oh, come on, Alani. Up there, up there, up there. Go get it up there. Good dog. Go get it. No, 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 no. Come on, Alani. Go get it. Good dog. Good dog. Good dog. Good dog. <laughs> she has two in her mouth. She has. Alani, come here. Come here. Come here. Drop him. So this is the footage of my cousin shooting his buck. And it's actually hilarious because we went in to sight in our guns on this gentleman's land that he let us hunt on. And we were going there to sight in our 17 HMR. And all this land that you see around us is all private property that we got permission to hunt on. And as we were going to sight in our guns... We spotted a bachelor pack of bucks sitting on the hill. And up there we spotted a 3x4 point, a lopsided 3x4 point, literally at the shooting range. The distance that he's shooting at is 272 yards, which unfortunately is too far of a range for me to zoom in and for you guys to see the buck. So this is the best I could do. Again. Follow him. Again. Wait. Again. He's above. Just straight up. Turn your scope out. I got it. Shoot him anywhere. Shoot him. Again. There is broadside. Right there. Oh, he's down maybe. Yeah, he's down. Can I do it again? Nope. Whew. Whew. I can't hear now. I can hear a bit. So I just now realized that I forgot to show a picture of my cousin's buck. But he did fire two more shots that I just didn't have recorded, so his total bullet count came out to seven. It was a little bit messy, but I'm still proud of him. He shot a big buck, so make sure you look at that at the end of the video. So my father also shot a buck, and it was big, but unfortunately I was not able oh, to record it because I just didn't have the time to get my GoPro out Whoa, and start recording it bro. by the time he shot it. He's but I will big. show you guys it because it is just truly incredible. Bro, he's big. Oh. Hey, bro, it's a big wide four point. Whoa. Woo. Woo. Oh. Baby. Woo. Woo! 
Bro! Four on each side! Big, wide, everything! So it really is a shame that I wasn't able to record what happened, but we did get some Perfect beautiful shot. photos with him, and he tastes pretty good, I'll tell you that. <laughs> enough all right everybody we're all packed up ready to go home but we're gonna do one last quail hunt before we actually go home so they're up there to the left of the hill gotta hike up there again without falling over and they know who I am all right as soon as I get out of the truck they start flying away 
So. Uh, get up there. See him moving up there. Flank them. I'll tell you, my legs are sore from hiking for the past two weeks, I'm going up and down this hill. Yep. So I'm gonna really try to minimize my shots. So I'm gonna make sure I'm in range. And make sure that there's more than one of them together. Like that. Oh. Got one. I'm not going to shoot that one yet. Oh, he's kind of big. There you go. He's down up there. So here's one. Small hen. All right. So there's one in the bushes over there. Um. You, oh, there's one right there. Two right there. Three right there. Come on, get in a group. Oh. So the reason why I didn't shoot those quail right there is because all three of them were hens. You can't really see that on camera, but they were. And I shot quite a lot of hens out of this flock, and I didn't really want to shoot any more. I was more targeting males. Shells. So this is my cousin's buck that I forgot to show you the picture of. It took him a few shots, but he still did a good job, and I'm proud of him. I just really want to thank you guys if you watched this far. It really helps me out. If you really could just do a favor and hit that subscribe button to help me get one subscriber closer to being monetized. But thank you guys so much, and have a great rest of your day.